I have my page open on layout and editing in version 7 of PIA Design. This technique can be followed in versions 5, 6 and 7. If you're using version 4, I'll discuss that a little bit later. Before we start, we just need to set the stitches up that we need. We don't need an outline, so we can turn that off. And we just want to go on the drop-down menu for the region fill and we want to choose Motive Stitch. Go to Sewn Attributes and we want to set ourselves up with 2 millimeters high, 2 millimeters wide. We don't need to select a motive. And if you're using version 6 or 7, we need to go down the bottom here and just select 2 millimeters on our run pitch. If you've got version 5, it will automatically be on 2 anyway, but you might just want to check and just say apply. We'll just move the sewn attributes out of the way for the moment. Now, I'm going to do a simple oval shape. You can also, if you've got the later versions, you do have the option of choosing one of these shapes down here, or you can actually draw your own as long as you're using the closed path tool. So we're going to use just a simple oval, and I've got my page set up on a 5 by 7 hoop. Just going to drag myself out an oval. And as you can see, we've just got straight lines going across. If we just select that, and we can go into our sonar attributes again, and just type in 45 and then we've got diagonal lines. Now we want to take the alphabet, we want to choose a true type font. I've actually got one called Vag Rounded here that I have on my PC, but any font that is a nice fat rounded letter, and I'm just going to type in the letter A and say OK. Select the letter, drag it out to a reasonable size, position it on our oval. Now we can select the oval and centre and then we can select the letter. And if we centre it at this stage, because with a true type you've got these extra boxes on the top, it doesn't actually want to centre properly. So we'll do the centering on the letter in a moment. While we've got that selected, we go up to text and convert to outline object. You can just about see it on there, it's a little dotted line. Now while it's selected, I can edit and centre, and it has actually put it in the centre. Select the letter, hold down the control key, select the outside, sew, set hole sewing. Now we're saying it's completely okay. We've made our hole, but it's also, because we're using the letter A, it's taken the hole out in the middle. So we just need to select that and just turn on the region so and our A will fill. So that's okay for the minute we've got our first layer.